So this month, as of this recording, is Sophie's twenty-first birthday, and I'm looking into getting her a limo. She really wants a limo. Maybe I'll get it for her. It's expensive, but I have the cash because my sister gave it to me. So yeah, I'm gonna get her a limo. Hmm. It's the new year, but there was a storm last night. I know, right? There's lots and lots of snow coming down, and look, it already knocked down a tree. I feel so bad for the animals living in there. I hope they can come visit Daisy. I'm pretty sure they'll be safe there while Sophie's asleep. I'll sleep with her too if I want. Well, it's 2019, and I want 2019 to be a good year. In fact, I want it to be a great year. I really hope that I actually can sing great, because I can't sing at all, unfortunately. So every time I sing karaoke, I sing horribly. So do you think I'll be able to sing? Probably, probably not. I don't know. But let's hope for 2019 to be an awesome year of fun and peace and love and cozy warmth. Daddy. Daddy. What is it, sweetie? Um, what's 2019? 2019 is the year we're in right now, sweetie. Oh, what's a year? A year is a time period that we're in. Like, um, last year was 2018, and now it's gone. And now we're in the new year, which is 2019. Oh, is that why I stood up late last night? Yeah. Oh, I see. What's going to happen in 2019? Lots of good stuff, I'm sure. Oh, okay. That sounds good. I love you, Daddy. I love you, sweetie. <laughs> I'm excited for Polly the movie, too. Mm. Oh. <coughs> oh. Uh. Look. DVD player. What's so great about that? Oh, it plays the Yellow Submarine DVD. And I love Yellow Submarine. I know that, Lindy, so do I. I'm wearing a Yellow Submarine shirt. I saw. Oh, man. I think I'm going to go watch Yellow Submarine. See ya. Okay, bye, Lindy. Interesting. <sighs> there we go. Now we're on the road again. And we made it. Oh. Hi. So, if you're wondering what I'm pulling... I'm pulling a wagon, but what's in this wagon? Puppets. That's right. This is a puppet wagon. My daughters, Cutie Core and Bella Bliss, don't know this, but I'm currently puppeteering a character on a show called Daffodil Jungle, which is 50 this year. All right, I'm going to show you the puppets that are in the puppet wagon. Um, here is Agatha Tiger, who speaks in a... French accent, and then we have, um, Ollie Giraffe, okay, and then there's, um, Jack, Jack is the elephant, and then the one that I puppeteer is Melody Monkey, that's right, she's a perfect role model for girls, too, I've been puppeteering her since a few years ago after her puppeteer retired, and my daughters love Daffodil Jungle and they don't know that I puppeteer Melody. I'm keeping the secret. Maybe they'll find out someday. Hopefully they will. <laughs> so yeah. Hope you like the puppets. Look at those yummy cupcakes I made, see? Yep. They're very good. <laughs> Some of them are vanilla. Most of them are chocolate. All of them are chocolate cake or chocolate frosting except the vanilla ones. <laughs> and they have chocolate sprinkles on them too. So yeah, here they are.
everyone, Charlotte Charades here. So I'm going to tell you a story about what happened on Christmas many years ago. When I was a little girl, we were preparing for Christmas dinner, and I almost ate the whole Christmas turkey. Why? Because it's my favorite part of Christmas dinner, and I got so hungry just staring at it that I ate half of it. But don't worry, I didn't get busted. We ended up eating the other half and all the other food that was there. So... Next time when you're having Christmas dinner with a turkey, do not eat the whole turkey until Christmas dinner. Bye. All right, it's 2019 after this recording, and I'm going to tell you what I want to do in 2019. I want to get my homework done on time, help others with their homework, and be kind to others. Oh, and go to the space exhibit at the Science Museum more than once, because I love space. So, yeah, I also want to be with my friends, being Barry. And I also want to get a driver's license. So, yeah. That's all I want to do in 2019. <laughs> Can't see anything Hello, more. Everyone. Today I'm going to review a Teletubbies DVD that Sophie has. And I have it too because I got it for Christmas this year. And it's Teletubbies Time to Play. Um, it has three episodes that never aired in the U.S. and Canada. And they all have the U.K. narration. So, yeah. Um... I like the yoga episode, and I like this one part where Poe is sleeping and the voice trumpet goes, wake up, wake up, wake up, time to get up. <laughs> and plus, the titles of the episodes are different than the actual titles of the episodes that aired in the UK. Like, I think, I think the yoga one was called A Busy Day, I don't know. But, yeah. Um, Sophie got it at Toys R Us when Teletubbies was turning 10, and... Now that Toys R Us is closed, I don't know what'll happen next, but I hear it might be coming back, and I hear that there was a place called Kibi Toys that might also be coming back. I hope it does. So yeah, um, that's my review of Teletubbies Time to Play. I hope you enjoyed it. It's 2019, but 2018 was a pretty good year for movies. It was a roller coaster of a year. So what was my favorite movies that I saw in a theater? Mary Poppins Returns. I remember back when I had a family, I used to watch the original Mary Poppins as a little baby. And Dick Van Dyke is an, the old man again in this movie, and he dances, and Lynn manuel Miranda plays some guy named Jack. <laughs> yeah, and Emily Blunt does a pretty good Mary Poppins. I know Sophie hasn't seen it yet as of this recording, but I told her it was good because I saw it on Christmas Eve of all of my friends while she and her family and her husband were seeing Bohemian Rhapsody, which I'm too young for. <laughs> but yeah, the songs are good, the movie's good. I recommend it. That's all I gotta say. Wow, <laughs> look outside. The snow is really coming down. Wow, it's like a foot out there. Man, I really hope school gets canceled tomorrow, but I know we're getting a field trip tomorrow, but maybe school will get canceled on Friday, because it's supposed to go on all week. I just really hope that we don't get stuck in traffic during the field trip tomorrow. That's all I gotta say. Hey, an announcement! Hey, this is Boyd. I want to let you know that test club has been canceled. Wow! Brian May from Queen just announced that Chess Club is cancelled. Yes! I'm not in Chess Club, so I guess I'm happy still. <laughs> hey, Bella, it's time for art class. Oh, time to go to art class. See ya.